Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius, what wine, girl? Let's talk about the planets. We're going to hop right into the reading. Okay, we're here for Venus. Another one. Another planet going into re uh, retrograde motion, and that will be the planet of Venus. It will be going retrograde in the sign of Leo, July. Let's check the, let's check the calendar. July 22nd until September 2nd. Now, y'all know how these readings go. You don't have to have Venus and Leo to be up in here, but your sun or your Venus could be in a fire sign or fire sign house. First, fifth, and the ninth. Check your chart. By the way, I am going to start posting more astrology facts and tips on my social media accounts, my TikTok and my Instagram. All that is located in the description box down below, including my contact and booking uh, information to book a personal reading with me. Thank you guys for all the continued support. Bookings like shirts, comments, subscribes, recommendations, tips, all that. I appreciate it. And the fellow fanatics of the stars like myself. Okay. So uh, what is Venus retrograde and Leo going to be about? Prepare for some issues regarding the home your personal possessions or issues with the body, okay? Some of y'all might need, uh, something here might need to get fixed, replaced, repaired, something here might uh, wind up damaged. Some of y'all might be facing this in regards to, like I said, your own body. Uh, breakouts on the skin, uh, weight and or health problems, bones, joints, pay attention to shit like this, okay? But retrogrades tend to show the flaws in certain things around you. So uh, something here might be outdated, something here might be showing a lot of wear and tear or there could be some health habits that you need to alter with yourself in regards to taking care of your body okay so we're going to pull one monthly oracle message card to see what the overall energy is going to be for this transit for you guys and then we're going to do a spread okay all right girl Let's go, spirit guys. How is this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs? Gee. July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023. Right, 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 right. Entrepreneur. I feel like I pulled this card for a pet. The, the Mars. This came out in the Mars and Virgo reading. So maybe go check that out. Okay, it looks like they're linking. Okay, Venus and Mars tend to be wouldn't say associates. They are definitely opposites, but they go hand in hand, okay? Entrepreneur, maker of thy own money, okay, or someone that is definitely capable of doing so. Some of y'all might be trying to make plans in regards to creating your own stream of income. You might be facing some difficulties and or changes in regards to you starting or maintaining your own stream of income. What's on the bottom? They're draining your energy. I feel like this exact same combination came out in the Mars reading. Go check that out, fire signs. I'm not being biased. Maybe just a little bit, okay? Because this same exact energy came out in that reading. So, um, ooh, girl, I just heard it. Some of y'all need to be careful about, you got to be the one that believe in your dream. Okay, even if, you know, you don't feel like anyone is uh, pouring support into you, you got to be the, you got to be your biggest cheerleader, basically. Okay, it's like, um, ain't nobody going to want it more than you, fire signs. Okay, um, I'm also seeing some of y'all might be, uh, I brought this up in the Mars reading. Some of y'all might, you know, have your own stream of income, but you might also work a side job. You might have a main job. You might still, you know, have a nine to five. You need to be careful about that taking you away from the income that you have created for yourself. That's going to always be there as long as you here. Okay. I'm not saying slack off at your job. I'm not saying do that, but just don't let your job overtake you if you are someone that's trying to create your own platform, business, or like I said, generate your own stream of income, okay? Let's do a spread. What are you trying to say now? I think so. Here we go, we good, we good, we good. We'll give y'all a quick shuffle, spirit guys. How's this Venus, oh, how's this Venus retrograde design of Leo affecting all fire signs? July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023. Now, I fell out booty up, so I'm not even going to look at it. I'm not even going to pay attention to it, all right? Spirit guys, how's this Venus retrograde sign of Leo affecting all fire signs? July 2nd until September 2nd in the year 2023. Ace of Cups. Love thyself. That's what came to mind. 
with the hermit card now a lot of y'all could be going through this whole spiritual enlightenment thing um as it relates to self-fulfillment what makes you feel good what makes you happy what do you feel content with you want to be in this space okay Stay hydrated, my friends. Please make sure that you are drinking your waters, going to the gym, eating fruits and vegetables, moisturizing, girl. Do all of that, okay? You you know when you when you look good, you feel good, okay? And when you when you feel good, you tend to look good, right? Hmm. Yeah. Uh, Sad, you out here the heaviest. Food card, hermit, two of swords, five of swords, and the page of pentacles. Through it all. Okay, I'm seeing some of y'all might not have had naysayers, but you definitely had people around you that kind of, that have kind of tried to, excuse me, deter you from being on a certain path or saying this isn't going to work out for you. This, is, this isn't this is going to come to fruition for you. But with the ace of cups, it's like, girl, as long as I believe it, I can achieve it. Okay giving after school program are we but some of y'all are in that energy you have the fool and the hermit uh car showing up showing up out here two of swords and the eight of wands is like i might not know where this is going to end up i might not know um where i'm going all the time <laughs> where the direction that something is going in but with the five of swords and the page of pentacles i'm not going to let the opinions of others or um self-doubt self-doubt keep me from going after certain things for myself if with the food card and the hermit i feel the urge to um get out my comfort zone try new things be in different surroundings um uh, have new ideas and actually act on those you gonna do it or you should or you should okay So here, guys, how is this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs? July 22nd till September, <laughs> till September 2nd in the year 2023. Nine of Wands, built a wall 10 feet tall. I really like this fire signs with the Ace of Cups and the Nine of Wands coming out. I'm seeing some of y'all are not easily frightened, scared off, deterred. It's like... When things, when you in the thick of it, when things get hard, that's when you, your, um, your strength tends to come through. Leo, I could be talking to you, but Sag, you are making an appearance, okay? Three of swords, eight of wands, and the two of swords. You, you will have downfalls. You've had, you, you had, girl, I'm about to start the reading over, okay? Adam, please cut that out. You have had the L's that you have taken, you will have L's that you will take. Or just eight of wands and three of swords. Things don't work out or pan out like how you thought they would. But I don't think that that keeps you from going after things that you want out of life. Things that you want to enjoy, experience. Some of y'all, I'm seeing this is love. You didn't have heartbreaks, girl. People, didn't, you know, stumped on it, pissed on it. Did you 30? Okay, in regards to love, with the ace of cups and the nine of wands, you haven't made that... You haven't let that make you a heartless person. You still believe that you still believe in humanity, basically. You still believe that there's good people out here. You still believe that true love exists, okay? Or just like I said, it's just good people out here. It's not just, you know, um dialed down to, you know, being in a relationship with someone. Oh, I see you are protecting yourself from anybody that carries the energy of jadedness, okay? It's like with the Nine of Wands, do you know the wizard? If not, get off the property. I will be forced to call the authorities if you don't. Some of y'all give off this energy to where it's like, if you're not willing to match me, <laughs> if you're not willing to match me in the way that I love myself, value myself, you can get the hell on. Okay, in a way that I respect myself, you can get the hell on. You are not putting up with people that are going to move a little shady or shysty in regards to you and not giving a fuck about hurting you. You will not let people like that around you or your energy will kind of repel people like that off rip. Okay, I'm seeing this is already happened. I see that it happened with an herb sign. I'm seeing that it happened with an air sign. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes. Yes, yes, it has, okay? So, you guys, how's this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs July 22nd until September 2nd in the year? 
Damn, girl, I saw what it was, too. Yep, there you go. Fell out face up. Eight town down, six of cups in reverse, and it fell out on the floor. Yeah, some of y'all are not letting certain people from your past come back. You done it. Okay, curtains. It's <laughs> you are not letting certain past connections or past people back around you. Nine of Wands and the Ace of Cups. You are a lot more protective over yourself. It's like certain people might have been able to get away with certain things when you was a kid. Okay, but when you stop being a child, you had to put childish ways behind you. Now, but it was just like whenever you really start to recognize your own power and what you bring to the table. Okay. What you can offer, who you is, what you carry, the type of energy that you carry. You ain't going to just allow yourself to be around any and everybody. You're not going to just allow any and everybody to experience you, okay? Mm -hmm. Look at it. Temperance, Tower, Divine Feminine. Yes, okay? Temperance, Tower, Empress, and the Moon card. Like I said, some of y'all have this sixth sense to feel when someone is carrying i'm hearing turbulent energy and with the nine of wands your guards just go up okay some of y'all this is spirit guides literally not letting certain people around you or circumstances not letting certain people around you because they already see the bullshit tempers in the tower card they gonna fuck our shit up girl don't let them around okay you have a strong sixth sense about that okay uh, i said this at the beginning of the reading some of y'all drink water Okay, drink your water. Stay hydrated, my friends. You ever got that, um, them cramps um, in your leg and shit? It's usually when you're dehydrated. Whenever you stretch it and your shit just cut, 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 cut. Okay, like a, like a transformer. Like a fucking Decepticon is in your leg, okay? Please make sure that you are drinking your waters during this time, okay? But yeah, some of y'all might experience some, some uh, oh, Lord, I hope not, like an injury, Something here might flare up, an old injury or something like that. Don't step on a crack. you break the mama's back. Oh, girl, be careful about where you're stepping. I don't want nobody with no twisted ankles out here, honey. Spirit guys, how's this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs July 22nd till September 2nd in the year 2023? Ten of Pentacles. With the moon card, yikes. I do see some of y'all don't mess with certain family members. And it could be family members that's close. Like, there's a sister you don't fuck with. There's an auntie you don't fuck with. There's a, a cousin you don't fuck with. Some of y'all don't fuck with your own parents, okay? Or a parent or grandparent, okay? Um, I'm not saying this. I'm not seeing that it's out of malice. Uh, Nine of Wands and the Ace of Cups is out here in your reading. And Three of Swords and the Five of Swords showed up at the bottom. This, for me, is like someone has done something to you or said something to you where it's like you can't take that back. You can't take it back, bitch, okay? I'm seeing some of y'all could be in the midst of a certain transition or you know you want to make a certain transition happen. Moon card, Six of Swords, and the Three of Wands. Aries, you're out here. Some of y'all might want to relocate. You want to move out your city. You want to move out your state. Whichever one, okay? Um, with the Moon card and the Six of Swords. Mums the word. Don't everybody don't need to know that. People at your job, your neighbors, some of your family, girl. I don't know. Some of y'all could have already made this happen, right? You could want to make this happen, or you could be in the midst of making this happen. When I say you could want to make this happen, you might realize this during this transit, okay? I'm seeing if that is the case, some of y'all need to make sure that you stay focused or stay committed to that. All right, um, nine minus three equals six of wands. I'm seeing some definite success if you decide to go through with this. Career changes, like I said, uh, relocation in regards to where you want to live during this time. Will of Fortune, you are definitely in this energy as to where it's like, I want to open more doors, okay? I'm, I'm trying to see what all is out there. Spirit, guys, how is Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023? The sun, which is you, fire signs, but the death card is in reverse on the bottom of the deck. Why would that be? Death card in reverse, three of wands, and the six of swords. 
I'm seeing some of you guys need to be careful about being um, resistant towards a certain change that needs to happen in your life. The lick have been taking the pain away. The death card um, implies very heavy, um, very strong shifts in your near future. Okay, they, I feel like you need to be receptive to. Um, you might be standoffish against it now, but it's like it's inevitable. Death is that, right? Three of Wands and the Six of Swords. It's like it's inevitable that you will move, leave this place, quit this job. You won't be in the same uh, space, whether it be a month, two months, a few weeks, or a year from now. All right. Spirit guys, how is this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023? Four of Wands. I told y'all, some of y'all is in regards to your living situation. Okay, the Ace of Wands is on the bottom of the deck. Some of y'all want to move. Um, nine minus four equals five of Wands. You might can't make that happen right now because I don't know you're dealing with, you know, uh, some sort of conflict during the time 1616 confirmations whether it be with your career job or just there's some things that you need to excuse me i'm here you might need to tie up some loose ends um before this relocation can take place some of y'all this is already taking place um and i think that you feel this was the best um move for you i do too i think it was a really good thing for you um, now, you have moved into a new chapter or a new cycle if you have already done this for the ones that have recently relocated, all right? But it's kind of like you like crash landed into this Ace of Wands, Knight of Swords, and the Hangman. So you might still deal with some delays, struggles, um, unexpected occurrences before you can truly be settled into this new chapter that you have, like I said, girl, you done ran into the building. Ran to the motherfucker, okay? Oh, girl, what the fuck is this? Um, Be aware, all right? Ace of Wands, Knight of Swords, Hangman, the Devil. If it's too good to be true, it probably is. Some of y'all need to be careful about new opportunities, new um, people, right? You need to be careful, okay, with the Ace of Wands and the Devil card. I'm, I heard being lured into something knight of swords and the hangman uh something here seems to uh happen really quick for how do i say it this for me is like could be like fast money um your focus right and something here comes out of the woodworks knight of swords for me is unexpected unprepared and uninvited you need to be careful about booyah distractions okay this will come in the form of people this will come in the uh, form of experiences situations circumstances and environments okay oh girl let's talk about it leo specifically aries you out here too sag you will be out here too because six plus four equals ten i'm seeing some of y'all I'm real, I'm real careful about saying this, but I'm going to say it anyway. I'm seeing some of y'all won against a certain situation, a uh, certain situation shit with somebody. Don't ask me what I just did, girl, okay? Just, just don't. I'm seeing some of y'all won in regards to a certain situation uh, with someone. Um, I feel like with the devil card, knight of swords, and the hangman, some of y'all, there could have been someone here who was holding you back in some sort of way, getting in the way of things for you, putting you in fucked up situations, girl. You got him up out of here. You got him up out of here, all right? You know, I was watching this um this TikTok, girl. I be getting lost in the TikToks, okay? So where um, this guy was saying, if someone feels like they can spin the block on you, you ain't did your job, okay? If someone here still feels like they can play around with you, you might haven't let, you You probably haven't set the record straight. Or it's just a nut that you're dealing with, okay? I feel like there's someone here that might still want to interact with you. I just heard toy, toy with you, toy around with you, but they know they ain't happening. Nine of Wands, you got boundaries now. You got standards, Okay, so this person know they ain't gonna, you know, they ain't, they, you ain't flying by. You gotta go through TSA. I gotta check your bag. 
Okay, you gotta get vetted. Uh, some of y'all, this will be new people. Six of Cups flew out, but it fell out on the floor. So I see you ain't letting nobody old back around you. No new friends. Okay, no, <laughs> no old friends neither. I don't know, girl. Uh, but some of y'all, this could have took place with an air sign. Aquarius and Libra has shown up pretty strong. Um, some of y'all, this could have happened with a water sign. Uh, cancer is out here, but probably any water sign. How the fuck did that get in here? It's like a fucking wasp or a hornet in here, bro. I thought I got his ass. Oh, motherfucker, you're lucky. Don't land, bitch. Don't land. Hold up, hold up, y'all. The curb stomp his ass. difficulties okay let's go ahead and keep moving spirit guys house is venus retrograde in the sound of the i'm not stopping this reading okay that's what i'm talking about the inconveniences the distractions he ain't stopping shit around here his life will end during this reading i don't give a fuck spirit guys house is venus retrograde in the sound of leo affecting all fire signs july 22nd to september 2nd in the year 2023 y'all got that in live time motherfucking warn it like what the fuck how that shit get in here Six of Pentacles with the world card. Um, I see I'm seeing some of y'all buying some things for the home. This could be furniture, this could be decorum. Um, pa 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 pa. Like I said, some of y'all is in regards to you relocating during this time, moving. Oh, congratulations. I see some of y'all receiving some sort of raise during this transit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yeah um world card six of cups and the five of cups i'm also seeing some of y'all being okay with certain things from your past not working out whether it be with people certain um goals that you went after five of cups if it you know girl if it turned into spoiled milk you okay it's like hey girl dims the brakes cherry card i gotta keep it moving i gotta keep I got to keep trying, okay? It's like some of you guys are in this. I told you at the beginning of the reading. It's like this energy is the word. It's like, yeah, I might, you know, fall from time to time, but that's not going to keep me from doing certain things with my life. Spirit, guys, how is this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs? July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023. Nine of Pentacles, I-N-D-E-P-E-N-D-E-N-T. We know what that means. Ace of Cups, Sun card, and the Nine of Pentacles. Now, the sun can be any fire sign, but everybody out here, Leo, Aries, and Sag. Some of y'all are very independent. Some of y'all are very independent, very stable, very self-sufficient, very self-reliant. It's like you wear confidence so well, okay? You're not arrogant. You're not vain. You're not, okay? It's just like with the Ace of Cups, you are someone that people definitely know. You love yourself. You value yourself, okay? You prioritize yourself. Mm-hmm. Some of y'all gonna scare insecure people away. Two of Swords, Five of Swords, and Knight of Cups. And what's crazy is... You you not even rude or mean. It's like your niceness might be what's the word I'm looking for, y'all? Intimidating to people. Um, your self assurance could be intimidating to people. Uh, two of swords, five of swords, and the knight of cups. What's five plus two? Seven. Showing up with the knight of cups. See, this is people who fake nice, who fake um being good people. Okay, and some of y'all are able to discern who is truly genuine and who you know truly isn't okay with the ace of so i'm telling you girl you got you you got the the, the sense the sixth one okay like i said some of y'all this already happened with someone heavy on the air gemini libra aquarius heavy on the water cancer scorpio has only showed up okay Night of Cups, this could have been someone here who who um wanted something from you. Somebody here that was trying to get something from you. They ain't get they ain't get too far. Okay. 
It's like I'm hearing that you you um you're going to or you have called someone's bluff and they they couldn't stand the heat. So they got the fuck up out the kitchen. Spirit guys, how's this Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023? I can't believe this man's still alive. He's still alive, y'all. <laughs> the death. He as he's reading girls over for him. Um, death, this shit right here. And it's upright this time. And it's actually coming out in your reading. So we got the sun and the death card. Some of y'all are definitely going through a certain rebirth during this um transit. Nine of wands, four of wands, and the death card, or you have already, right? Some of y'all this is in regards to your living situation, uh moving. Um, some of you guys, this is in regards to getting through certain issues or conflict as it relates to how you're living during this time. Um, like I said, you might got to get something replaced. You might got to deal with some damages. You might got to deal with some, um, some sort of hiccups. Like I say, in regards to your day-to-day -day life judgment, as long as you're doing the right thing. Okay. It's like, I'm not going to say the, 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 the ride won't be bumpy. I'm just saying you're going to get through it. Okay. Cause with the nine of pentacles, you're resilient. You can do it, okay? With the nine of wands. It's like you don't give up easily. Last card. Spirit God's house is Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo affecting all fire signs. July 22nd until September 2nd in the year 2023. Oh, shit. Two of cups. That's okay. Well, it's good and it's bad. Let me tell you all the bad first, okay? I do see some people here uh, going through a breakup, whether this has already happened or, you know, it's going to happen sometime during this transit. I'm only seeing this happening with an earth or a water sign. Um, I'm hearing it's like some people are realizing that the person they could be with, it's like complete opposites. Like y'all can't, y'all can't come to a certain understanding with one another, Okay. You like different things. They like different things. They want certain shit out of life that you don't want out of life. You want certain shit out of life they don't want out of life, okay? No wrong with that. I just don't think y'all compatible. Some people here might realize it's about someone that they currently with. Or this has already happened, okay? Good. Some of y'all, this has already happened. And you could be in a new situation, new connection uh, with someone during this time. Um, you might be dealing with someone that's not your, your, your regular Okay, you might be dealing with someone who I feel like could be a little bit more, well, not more. Um, it's like you done, you, you done bought the knockoff. You know, you didn't, you didn't have to use the knockoff before. So you know what the real deal is like now, all right? Like you know who, uh, you know what it's like to deal with someone who genuinely likes you, genuinely values you, is genuinely interested in you versus someone who's, you know, very shallow, very surface level, just wants, you know, use you to for their own benefit. All right. Uh, Ten of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups. I do see some of y'all. I wouldn't say marrying your career. I just see you kind of... Um, realizing what you want in regards to your stability like what do you want to come out of certain career situations that you have during this time some of y'all plan to buy a house some of y'all planning to like i said make that relocation happen some of y'all are making plans to start your own business start a certain stream of income it's like i welcome this new chapter Fire signs. This was your Venus retrograde in the sign of Leo reading. Okay, um, I don't have any other placements, just Sun and Venus and fire signs. Like the video, leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. My pricing and content information to book a reading with me is in the description box down below. All the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. All right, girl. I gotta go terminate. Okay. <laughs> Bye, y'all.